Once every four years, the Hicks and Lee College invests in a collaborative production between the Johnny Carson School of Theater and Film and the School of Music. And for that production, we approach a show that is much larger in scope and scale than the productions we do in the intermittent years. Although I can only write with half my ears, I am missing one buttock. <laughs> it's really overwhelming and I'm really thankful that I, that I got to take part in the production. And, and then I got to, to learn another role, and a great role, uh, and it's a show that's not very often performed, actually, so it's, it's a really neat opportunity in that way as well. The students have the opportunity in coachings, in workshops, and in rehearsals to actually learn the skills that they're going to be putting on stage when they actually get to the performance of the show. I was not born in sunny España. And I really treasure those moments when I get to talk to a student and see them do something that they've never done before. The props are all very different in nature, and the undergraduate students are having a wonderful experience learning how to find props that match the period and location of the scene in which they'll be used, and also how to create things from scratch. I sometimes feel like a hoarder, like we have so many objects, but uh, right now we're working on these sheep. We went and found uh, real sheep, and we measured them, and it was super fun. Kind of smelly. I'm going through and checking the list against the stuff on the racks to see what's finished and what's not. The costume designer researches historic costumes and tries to recreate a sense of time and place through the costumes she creates. This is an excellent program because it provides a lot of hands-on opportunities that involve the student at all different levels of the production process. Okay, so what this is right now is um, metallic gold paint mixed in with some of the polyacrylic sealer. The students who are working with the designers on building the set pieces are learning how to do faux painting, to paint so that things look dimensional even though they're flat on stage. This is great. It's everybody's dream to be able to paint something this big and, and detailed. about over 250 lights in this show. I have had a lot of opportunities since I've been here that I don't know if I would have gotten elsewhere, and so it's been a really great experience and I've learned a lot. There's only like two more on side arms. You know, really collaborating with the Hickson Lead College is something that we only get to do every three to four years. I couldn't imagine going anywhere else for school. The director and the conductor have to have a very fine collaboration. Today we're having one of the most exciting days in our preparation for Candide. We are having a Zitzprobe. The word is the it's German for sitting rehearsal. So it's a combination of the orchestra and all the singers, but minus costumes and minus action on the stage. I think it's um, cool to be part of a production like this. So it's kind of fun on this project. We're building um, a bathtub. It's like really hands-on compared to most classes you take. months of planning and drawings and uh, discussions and arguments and problem solving, it, it finally comes together. So 
having this huge set of collaborators on this project makes it all the more involved and really impressive, and it gives us more to work with. Whatever shall we do now? Super duper, standby lights 0 0.2. Yep, that's perfect. And can it be downstage just one smidge? This was really great. This yeah. rehearsal was really, was really efficient and definitely an exciting step forward. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe it's over.